While it's true that finding a solution often entails leaving your comfort zone, this hasn't deterred entrepreneur Silvana Dantu and Shreen Parker from thinking out of the box and the bottle. They decided to take grape juice to a whole new level, so I met up with them for a tasting. Grapes are the gold of the Cape Winelands, and while the fermented product may have received all the glory up until now, grape juice is at last being treated as a premium product, fit to be served at the finest tables. This is largely thanks to the vision, enterprise and tenacity of Silvana Dantu and Shireen Parker. Silvana and Shireen are a powerhouse entrepreneurial duo who believe that growth comes from stepping out of your comfort zone and exploring the opportunities around you. I'm intrigued to find out how that philosophy has panned out for them. Silvana, so lovely to meet you. Welcome to Mela. Lovely to meet you too. This is such a beautiful location. Crude Constantia has a very rich history. It's still a very, very popular international wine destination. It's a heritage site and it's the oldest producer of wine in the country. Your story as an entrepreneur is so inspiring. Where did it all begin? I had a grandmother that encouraged me to reach for my dreams and that the sky is the limit. And I really took a leaf out of her book. What are some of the highlights of your career being thus far? I was very privileged to start off in a job as a researcher and I became the research editor of an international American magazine. And that was the beginning of accumulating a very significant network for myself. I then went on to do a stint in Parliament and then I was fortunate enough to be invited to become part of the team appointed to set up the Robben Island Museum. So Shireen and I met at Robben Island and we decided to collaborate and start a new business. Essentially, it was a tourism development and marketing and media company. We were involved in significant projects and six years ago, we decided to diversify and get into grape juice production. Viticulture is a term used for the cultivation and harvesting of grapes. And the production of quality grape juice involves more than just picking the right berries and squeezing them. Selecting the right cultivars was one of the many decisions that had to be made. And Silvana and her partner face a steep learning curve. They also set out to create a new product for an upmarket niche, which meant that she and Shireen were largely on their own. Finding the perfect fit in a partner, whether in life or business, is not always easy. Why do you think you and Shireen work so well together? We really complement each other's skills and experience. We nurture each other's strengths, but we work equally hard and we're accountable to each other. And I think that's what makes a perfect partnership. Meanwhile, Shireen was preparing a luncheon on the lawn because to call this delicious selection of fresh fruit, cheese and biscuits a picnic would be doing it an injustice. Bottles full of fruity flavour were waiting to be sampled. I would love you to meet my business partner, Shireen Parker. Shireen, so lovely to meet you. And great meeting you too. Wow, this looks so beautiful. Yes, the hand of Sylvana's creativity. How did the idea of Zari come about and how did it develop into what it is today? Initially, it was just myself wandering around the wine estates because I don't drink, but I certainly appreciate the beautiful architecture and grape juice. But Estates were very reluctant to display grape juice on their shelves together with their wines and most of them produced grape juices. We decided that we were going to be the ones to create a quality single cultivar grape juice made of the Muscat seedless grape. It is alcohol free, it has no added sugar, it's not diluted with water, it is cold pressed. So it retains all the natural goodness of the fruit. What does Zari mean? It means the beautiful silver and gold thread in Middle East material. What's next for the both of you? Creating a space for the discerning palate who wishes to just chill, but in an alcohol-free environment. Would you mind if we pop one of those beautiful bottles over there? Oh, certainly. I can't wait for you to taste this amazing drink. If anyone thought that grape juice can't be bubbly, the proof was in the pub. Thank you. 